Um, can I shoot him in the ass? Yeah, I can shoot him in the ass. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy gaming, and it is Horde Night 98. And yeah, we are going to take on the Horde tonight. So I have spent uh, pretty much the entire Horde day uh, back at the mine, and we dug down a few more layers. I got a little more iron. Uh, so that I could get a little bit more steel. So uh, we certainly don't have an abundance of it, uh, but we have a decent amount. So I've got, well, yeah, nine pieces in there and 70 pieces in here. Uh, we have two over 200 pipe bombs. We've got over a thousand, um, what are these called? 762s, over 300 shotgun shells. Everything's repaired. And uh, we're in pretty good shape. I also made um, a few Molotovs too. Uh, so we'll be... Utilizing those tonight, I have uh, upgraded pretty much this entire enclosure here is now titanium, upgraded to titanium. Um, and yeah, so we'll see how things go tonight. The base itself is pretty much the same as it's always, uh, well, not always been, but has been for the last couple of um, Horde Nights. Um, so I haven't like added to it. Uh, but this time I have the stuff that I need to keep the electric fences repaired. So as long as we can keep these things repaired, we should not have any difficulty uh, keeping the horde under control. Um, so we have, you know, the the two, I had to replace one of these hatches here. So we got that done and they're both fully upgraded and we should be good. Yeah, so I've got um, recogs and atom junkies and all that stuff on me. I think we're going to start the night off uh, with some sledgehammer work, so we'll we'll take the skull crushers. I am also wearing my um, nerdy glasses for XP. And um, so, yeah, let's, let's get this party started here, man. Let's rock and roll. As long as we keep those fences going and they don't, you know, break, they will keep the hordies from doing major damage to the base. What the hell, man? That is not allowed. I can't. Oh shit! We got a demo already. <laughs> Crap, man. That is not right. I can't believe they sent a demo to us like right away. All right, that's um. Here, let's uh, light him up. And um, maybe with one of these too. Wow, I was not expecting a dem a demolisher like right off the bat. That's crazy. Fortunately, the fence is keeping him from really doing any damage. So, I, I just don't want to shoot him, man, because it's way too early in the evening for a demolisher to blow up on us. Okay. I don't know if we killed him or knocked him off or what, but... Okay, let's check our fences. It's that bottom one that's taking the majority of it. Let's give him a double. Okay, I don't know. Is the demolisher dead? That's a biker there. Am I not hitting her? What the hell? It's like it's not even hitting me. That is really bizarre. Yeah, I, I'm going to start making better use of Molotovs. I mean, we, you know, gas is no longer an issue. We might as well, right? It, it really does make a difference. What's up with my sledge not hitting anybody? Okay, I guess it hit him that time. Yeah, these um these fence posts make this design so much easier. Let's pop some heads here. Let's 
Very nice. Oh, okay. I think that's the same one we've had all along. He's not even halfway down yet, so let's light him up again. Oh! Well, alright. Well, um, I don't know how that happened. I really don't. Um, but let's touch these up. Better give, um, these a little bit of attention too, and we gotta make sure that these guys stay repaired, because there are there are bread and butter here, man. I haven't even looked at my game stage for a long time. It must be pretty high if they're sending demolishers like right at the beginning of Horde Night. Alright, there's a new one. Oh, shit. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. I'm trying to blow myself up here. Okay, let's give him a double. Yeah, this would be a different story, man. If it wasn't for the electric fences. It's hard for me to... to get to him. Um, can I shoot him in the ass? Yeah, I can shoot him in the ass. <laughs> Alright! Yeah, demolishers right off the bat. That's exactly what we wanted tonight. He really did do a bit of a number on the, the hatch there. Here, let's look and see what's in here. We got some uh, herbal antibiotics. That's good. We got a treasure map. All right, let's bash some heads. So I think we got, we must have had like two demolishers. Or maybe it was just the one, I don't know. No blowing up, cops. Not allowed. Take them heads off. Man, electric fences are just OP, you guys. I'm not complaining though. Don't get me wrong. Just saying. Okay. Slide him up. And I want to check the fence post here. Now they're not doing too bad. It's mostly the lower one that's getting all the action. Got a double. What do we got here? I need some more uh, steroids. I'm running low on them. Of course, we have a lot of... Uh, testosterone, so we could probably make them, too. Get out of there, spider. Alright, let's check our... our hatches. They're in pretty good shape. Let's warm things up a little bit. Ow. That hurt. That gave us an abrasion. Cop spit gives abrasions. That's okay. They don't do anywhere near as much damage as the demos do. Hey, I wonder if the scorpions 
sh you know, in the new um, update show up on Horde Night. That would be crazy, man. Okay, let's check our fences. They're doing really good. They really do make this whole process much, much easier. Well, that and the titanium. Give those a couple of taps. Okay, I think we have, yeah, we have another demo. Let's light him up. Um, I don't want to shoot into there because I don't know where the demo is. I can't really tell. So let's just do some more explosives. In fact, you know what? Since we have a demo, uh, let's take an Atom Junkie so we have a little extra punch here. I think he might have been knocked off the ladder, so he's probably on his way back up. Okay, there he is. Give him a double. All right. I've got a bad uh, about this. He must have. Yeah, he must have got knocked off there. There he is. Okay, he's about halfway down. All right, that took his health down quite a bit. Where's he at? Oh, he must have fallen off. Okay. Okay, let's check our hatch here. It's in pretty good shape overall. The demo's probably coming back up here. Okay, let's check our fence posts. Yeah, they're not even hardly touching the upper one. It's interesting. Two skill points. Very nice. Is that demo dead? So far, so good.
right, it is morning. Now we just have to wait for the rest of these yahoos to clear out of here. Oh, that's right, I don't have any shotgun shells left. <laughs> I made some more at the base because I knew I'd probably use most of them up tonight. Last little batch here, probably. Still hear footsteps. They just want to keep coming. Sledgehammer improved to 81, nice. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. That calls for some spaghetti. Oh, no, I hear someone else coming. Some spaghetti and some mineral water. And maybe some red tea. Big mama, you want a little more action, huh? Okay. They're still coming, for Pete's sake. Some of those are probably just normal daytime Zeeks that got uh, uh, you know, drawn in by everything. Okay, I think we're done. I think we're done. So yeah, fence post, guys. <laughs> Ain't this a walk in the park, man? Fence posts and, and titanium. Because we did get the one demo explosion. But, yeah. That was just almost too easy, to be honest with you. Not that I'm complaining, mind you. We have almost... we. Ha I don't think we have any destroyed blocks at all. We just have a little touching up to do it, and we're good, man. So this... Uh, after oh, shit! <laughs> I forgot I gotta turn the fences off. Uh, I have to say, this is... Definitely one of my more effective horde-based designs that I've done in this game. Um, I don't see any reason why this wouldn't work fine in, in um, you know, vanilla, too. But, yeah. Super, super successful horde night. Most of the issues we've had prior to this were me doing stupid things like forgetting to bring stuff to repair the fence posts and all that. Um, the turret is not working Master, we so are not alone. it must be it must have been like damage from perhaps the demolisher explosion or something so we're gonna have to fix that uh, but let's drop a few of the heavier things off and we'll go down and get the fat loots and then i'll worry about you know uh, fixing everything up around here later but all we have to do is just repair a few blocks and we're good. Because, like I said, I don't think we lost any blocks at all. Okay, so that's uh, all we can put in there. Let's exchange a couple lighter things uh, for some heavier things. Uh, maybe you, you, and you. I'm going to make sure I have a full complement of... Uh, seven six twos in case we run into issues down below. Okay, and we want to switch back to our uh, lucky goggles. All right, let's see if we can get any good loot pieces out of here. Oh, we did lose a block. We did lose a block. Okay. Um, and yeah, maybe a couple blocks there too. That's well, actually, this I think with this was just glass, so that's not really that big of a deal. Okay, yeah, so let's go. A lot of the loot, you know, just dropped up above, 
Anyway. Oh, he's stuck there. That's not the first time Zombos have, have been stuck uh, in that little spot. It's kind of funny. Ooh, that's a nice find. That is a really nice find. I have one of these back to base, but I'm not sure if it's an orange one. So, have picked up something. Yeah, we'll take it. Also a nice find. Man, look at that. Is that better than the one we have? I think it is not. I don't know. I'll have to... I'll have to look at that. Let's see. Okay, just some basic stuff there. More research data and some more bandages. Uh, we'll scrap that. Oh, those are nice. Uh, in fact, looks like they might even be better than what we're currently wearing. Okay. That's a nice upgrade. We've got a block busted out there. More ravioli we can use for spaghetti. We'll scrap this. And we got some shotgun shells back. Alright. I think that's about it. Let's reload this. Make sure everybody else is loaded up. And I would say that was a pretty doggone successful horde night. Um, let's see. This has a base damage of 10, 110.6. This one has a base damage of 94. Yeah, so the one we have is definitely much better, uh, even without the mods. Very cool. All right, you guys. So, yeah, I just have a little bit of touch-up to do, a little bit of repairing, a couple of blocks to replace, but nothing major at all. And, you know, the again, the fence posts were the... You know, we're the star of the show, for sure. Uh, you know, made something that would have been a little bit sketchy and touch and go. Uh, a, almost a walk in the park. Not quite, but almost. Um, so, yeah, very pleased with how everything worked out. All right, well, um, I'm going to go ahead and just wrap up this episode here because this is a good place for us to stop. Um, I will, you know, get everything all fixed back up here for the next Horde Night. Um, the only thing I might possibly do different for the next horde night is put in a dark trap that shoots down on them one of you guys suggested that in the comments and i would like to do that and looks like we're gonna have to repair you too i think i'm pretty sure the sledge turret took its damage yeah from the uh, from the demo in fact let's just repair this now so i don't forget and we'll just set it back down oh there's a thingy there look at that steak and potato nice and more shotgun shells All right, and then we'll just put you back down so that way you're ready to go for next time. Beautiful. Okay, guys, sounds good. So I'm not sure what we're going to do in the next episode. I'm still, you know, working hard on, on the mine. Uh, we got to get the, uh, I want to get the turret set up, and I will definitely show you guys that on camera. So that's probably tentative tentatively anyways going to be what we'll do in the next episode or at least part of what we'll do in the next episode so yeah uh, with that thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed this episode and if you did please hit that like button subscribe to the channel leave a comment share the video and we'll catch you in the next episode Bye bye